My name is Tyrone, Tyrone Washington, also known as Munchie. Who is Munchie? And for the longest, girls and music have been the only thing on my mind. Reality hit when my ex got an abortion of the child that I actually wanted. But you know what they say, you can't force a woman to do anything. It's her body, not yours. So I've moved on completely. In my entire life, my mom has been my scrimp. And to this day, I'm grateful for everything she's done for me. Too many times the women I get involved with friends will say, girl, you know you can't trust a light skin, but come on, look at me, I'm just Tyrone, a 22 year old trying to be happy and make ends meet. Can you blame me? Ever since you left the city, I Since you left the city, yeah. I've been drinking more, girl. I've been smoking more, girl. Ever since you left the city, yeah. I've been drinking more, girl. I've been smoking more, girl. Yeah. Cause you do what that's for yourself. I'm guessing you don't need my help. I'm thinking you got someone else. I bought her this shot for myself. I'm facing this blood on myself. I'm thinking you got someone else. I'm hoping you got no one else. I'm hoping you got no one else. You take a trip to New York. You turning up by the shore. It don't feel the same as before. I'm starting to pray a bit more. You crossing my mind a bit more. I tried to call you and no. You say that you don't, but I know that you do. I know how my nigga be testing you. I can't be mad, that's what niggas do. And what can I say you reply to? Man, this shit is so crazy. I haven't been asleep lately. My uncle keeps saying I'm crazy. Cause your name be coming up lately. I just be talking about you. I can't keep my mind up off 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 you. I put on the table song? Hell yeah, yeah, you know I got Mr. Yell on the way, man. It's Nico Bay on Spring Rhythm. Shit, nigga. Hey, what's up with the feature? Shit, yeah, nigga. Bruh, it's in here waiting on you, bro. Let her go. 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 This is shit I want you to get on right quick, though. I what is it called, bro? It's called Got Down on Me and You. Song for the females or something? Hell yeah. You gotta know how I do. Okay. You got Nick coming out, though. Shit, bro, really? I just got a whole tape. Got down. I gotta add some videos. That's really about it, though. Okay, shit. Word. If you get this shit done, bro, I'm gonna drop it with you. I've always been good with the ladies. I think I stress more about meeting the father. You always want to make the first impression the best impression. 
But fuck, <laughs> I'm already late. You're late. Uh, sorry, sir. I was wrapping things up at work. Where you work at, son? Corner Beach Recording Studio. Or oh, that's not a no real job. Uh, no disrespect, but anything that pays the bills is a real job. <laughs> hey, sir, I just got your text. Got your text? You damn kids need phone. You mean text? Uh, it's a traditional way come to the door. Like you're come on, Dad. To... Nobody's your age. Come on. Come on now. It's okay. Bye, I love you. Bye. Bye, you kids be careful. <sighs> like your dad was tripping by the studio thing. Thanks. You told my dad you worked at the studio? Yeah. Why would I lie? Because that doesn't impress anyone's parents. You tell everybody that? Yeah. Again, why would I lie? I didn't lie to you. You know I worked at the studio. But I didn't think you were going to stay there. Man, listen, man. I want to do music, man. That's what I do. Like, I want to stick to that. You want to be like everybody else? No, I just want to do what I do and make money off of what I like to do. Just like everybody else in high school said the same thing. You know how many people said that and want to be famous? And how many don't become famous? A ton of them. Only one made it. Only one. Speaker knockers. And he did. So, you going to be next? Man, I don't even know why we even trying to do this. You know, I, I don't even, I don't know why either, you know, because it just, no. I'm going back to that. I can't believe this girl is breaking up with me because I'm following my dreams. Why would you be with someone then try to change them after the fact? This is my never ending battle with women. Hey. Lately I've been cooling in my zone. When you see me, it's looking like I'm on. Baby says she wish she made a clone to take me home. Come in, Ma. Hey, son. How was your day? <sighs> Man, me and Kelly broke up. Oh, I'm sorry. What did she do? Because I knew it wasn't you. I mean, I told her the truth. Like, I told her that I work at the studio. He, he really didn't, like, approve of it. Went out to dinner and all that. She just wasn't, she wasn't feeling the whole fact that I just want to do that, music. Apparently, she thought this is just temporary. Oh, baby, I'm sorry. This is like the third girl this summer. I mean, Ma, I've knew Kelly since day one. And like... Are you moving too fast? I, I don't know. Like, I always thought that maybe me and her could work. She just keeps trying to change me. Like, she don't understand that music is my passion and this is what I want to do. She wasn't going to be happy and I know she wouldn't fully support me anyways. There's no point. Well, son, you know I love you. And I will support you. I already know, Ma. You know the right girl is going to come along. You just have to be patient, okay? Yeah, I know, Ma. Thank you. Well, I'm going to head to bed. I thought I'd just come in to say goodnight. Good night, Ma. Love you. Love you, too. See, why can't all women be like my mom? Just love me for me. <sighs> oh, well, whatever. Man, I wonder how many people sit on their phone every morning looking on Instagram and Twitter. What's up, Tish? <laughs> how are you? I'm good. How did you sleep? Pretty good. <laughs> I'm good enough for a good morning call now. Maybe. <laughs> well, how'd you sleep? I slept okay. How are things for you and Kelly? I definitely don't want to talk about this right now. Okay. We broke up last night. Yeah, I know. She posted something on Instagram. I'm not surprised. I'm just tired of this. 
Every female is with the same old, same old. I'm a ladies man. Yeah, I know. Well, why would you ask if you already knew about it? To see if you wanted to talk about it or if she was just being extra. I feel like you're going after the wrong girls. <sighs> All the right ones is not interested. Oh, hush. Mm. 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 I'm gonna have to call you back. I gotta go. Okay, bye. All right. I swear she crazy, crazy. The way that I beat it, that pussy, she thinks she my lady. I beat it up, the way that I beat it up. I swear that she crazy, crazy. She keep on calling me daddy, I'm calling her baby. Man, JJ out here again. Artie, how he gonna beg me for money? Hey, yo, T. I ain't really got no money right now, bro. I ain't even gonna lie. But you also get lost in the sauce. You can get, how you get lost in the sauce? Yo, yo. Something real shit, bro. I was trying to put you on some shit, bro. I was trying to see if you were trying to make some bread, bro. I'm out here making this money, B. Bro, I'm good, bro. What you got, though? What I got? Shit, man, I'm out here making this bread, bro. You know what I'm saying? Got, got some pills on me. Man, I, bro, hold on, bro. I got that soft too. Get this shit away from me, bro. I'm straight. Bro, shit, bro. We out. Bro, I'm straight, bro. I gotta go anyways, bro. All right. Yeah. All right, bro. Just holler at me if you need something, bro. All right, bro. Appreciate it. Man, that does sound good. But 12 already on me and my boys, and I know that's a jail sentence waiting to happen. Man, I'm not fucking with Jay. Baby, I know you like how my hands on you. Sauce on you. Drip on you. I know you like how my hands on you. Sauce on you. Drip on you. Man, who the fuck could this be? Yeah, you know my name. So, what is it that you mean? You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can Don't fight. Don't fight. You might become another hashtag, homeboy. Shit. But damn, you gotta be kidding me, dog. You just gonna sit there and stare at me? No. I'm waiting for someone to bring me something. What, a file? <laughs> I've never been arrested, so what, what they gonna bring you? You don't have a file of yourself, but your file is built up on the relationships you have with others. What do you mean? Like, what are you talking about? Can you tell me who this is? JJ? The fuck does that have to do with me? It's JJ. I know her, bro. I don't really know her like that, though. What about her? Bro, what the fuck is this? It's my ex. Well, we think these two are involved in drug trafficking. Man, what does that have to do with me, man? That's between you and them. Like, that has nothing to do with me, bro. Nothing at all. So explain the drop-offs between you and JJ for the past couple of months. Man, look, bro, I was just giving a broke nigga some money. That's it, bro. I felt bad for the man. Here's how we have it. For the last couple of months, you've been giving JJ money in exchange for his services. Every what time you give him the money, fuck money, is this woman talking about? Twice a month. Drugs. I smoke weed from time to time, but I don't sell this shit. I don't sell drugs. Okay. Earlier today, we saw you two at the gas station, and he obviously had drugs with him, which leads us to believe you are involved. As for Kelly, she's been selling drugs for the longest. We've been on her for a while now. Man, listen, lady. Your story wrong. If I was selling drugs, you think I'm going to be walking around here with this whack-ass shirt 
Dropping that whack ass car out there and fucking these ugly ass bitches. No. I hear what you're saying, but all signs point to you. You should really focus on who you hang around with. Are you serious? Man, can I get a lawyer? Lately, I've been cooling in my zone. When you see me, it's looking like I'm on. Baby says she wish she made a clone to take me on. We can do what you wanna do. You ride for me, I'ma ride for you. You down for me, and I'm down for you. Any circumstance, I'll die for you. We can do what you wanna do. You ride for me, I'ma ride for you. You down for me, and I'm down for you. Any circumstance, I'll die for you. Damn. It was like yesterday. You driving. That's some crazy shit. I know my head gone, but I gotta make us away. How the fuck did I get here? I'm never smoking this nigga weed again. <laughs> the fuck was that? <laughs> that shit crazy. Don't forgive me for my sin, and I pray to God this ain't my end. She is my bunny, and I am her clyde. I am the keys, and she is my ride. She know I'm a music, yeah, I'm on the rise. If I just a nigga, she don't go outside. When I'm in the streets, some Nico. When I'm in that bed, I'm Nico Bay. Still that same nigga that took your lady. I fuck her so good, she won't have my vibe. When I'm in the streets, some Nico. When I'm in that bed, I'm Nico Bay. Still that same nigga that took your lady. I fuck her so good, she won't have my vibe. Hey. Lately, I've been cooling in my zone. When you see me, it's looking like I'm on. Baby she I wonder if that dream was trying to tell me something. To take me home. We can do what you want to do. You ride for me, I'm going to ride for you. You down for me, and I'm down for you. Any circumstance, I'll die for you. Hello. Hey, can we talk? Yeah, man, as long as you don't put it on the book. Uh, don't start. Man, can we just keep some things to ourselves? Man, you ain't got to put everything on social media, man. I didn't call you to argue. I, I guess, but um, you think I can call you a little later? Protesters taking to the streets in Tulsa, Oklahoma, after a police officer shot and killed an unarmed black man on Friday. Crutcher was gunned down by Officer Betty Shelby. She was responding with other officers to two 911 calls about a car stopped in the middle of the road. We're going to show you part of the police video uh, that they released. We warn you, it is disturbing. Here. Well, he's got his hands up there for her now. I'm going to hit the recorder. This guy's still walking. They're following commands. Not for Taser, I think. That's a, got a feeling that's about to happen. That looks like a bad dude, too. To be honest with something. Family is obviously outraged by what you see and, frankly, what you hear. Uh, police characterizing their loved one as a bad dude in the midst of that altercation. Joining us now is the attorney for Officer Betty Shelby, Scott Wood. Counselor, thank you for joining us this morning. It's important to get perspective uh, from both sides in a situation like this. What do you see in that video that justifies lethal force? What's wrong, Mom? Something happened at work? Oh, baby, I'm just tired. That's all. Did you watch the news? No, nah, not really. <sighs> Have you been seeing all the killings on social media? Yeah. <sighs> it's crazy. I don't, I don't know what's going on in the world. Well, much when you didn't come in last night, <laughs> it worried me. I mean, nowadays it's so sad that I have to think like this, but I do. I'm sorry, Ma. I I went to work, me and the guys went out, me and the boys, I fell asleep at Nico's house. You shouldn't have to worry about me though, I'm okay. Monkey the boys, that's exactly what I'm worried about. You don't know what kind of things they're probably into. You could be at the wrong place at the wrong time. Now baby, I'm going to need you to be mindful who you're hanging around these days. 
Mom, listen, I'm okay. I'm sorry, Mom. I had a key, my bag of Yo, Kelly, what up? Can you come pick me up? Actually, no. I'm not in the mood. Well, look, I really need to talk to you about something. Kelly, bro, this is weird. Why you can't talk to me now? I don't think we should talk over the phone about it. You're not pregnant or anything, are you? No, time when I'm not, but I'm glad to see how you react if I was. I mean, I wasn't saying it in a bad way. I'm just asking. So, uh, will you come over tonight? Is your dad home? He should be going to bed soon. Nah, I'm good. We could talk over the phone. I'm not in the mood to hang out with you. Okay, fine. Look, I need help getting out of this situation. What's the situation? You know JJ from the gas station? He kind of put me... Us in the middle of something. Look, Kelly, I don't want anything to do with you or JJ right now, for real. Why are you tripping so hard? You don't even know what it is. My guess? It involves drugs. What? No. Why would it involve drugs, fool? You know I don't smoke. Man, well, what is it then? Because you acting weird. Okay. Well, do you know how we met? Yeah, we went to middle school together, so what? Yeah, we went to school together, but we didn't start talking seriously. I'm until confused, Kelly. Where is this going? What does this have to do with JJ? He's my ex-boyfriend. Yeah, okay. So what? What does that have to do with me? Why are you being so rude? Damn, I'm just trying to talk to you like an adult. So you called to tell me your ex-boyfriend about the other ex-boyfriend just to talk to him about him? I'm confused. Uh, look, man, just go get tested. Tested? Yes, tested. <laughs> 